So it's October, it's the fall, it's time for all things pumpkin-y, pumpkin spicy, and I've been really long suffering up to this point until Post has created this abomination. It's my pleasure. I love Twinkies, love Twinkies since I was a kid. In fact, I took one on the kindergarten uh, pumpkin trip when I was five years old. These horrible abominations should have never been created. Pumpkin spice Twinkies. So we're gonna take care of this. And we're gonna take care of everything that's pumpkin spice related today. I think the Brooklyn Slammer is going to show you all how I feel about pumpkin spice Twinkies. They're very resilient. They are an abomination to nature. They're going to be easier to eat than ever though. Oh, there we go. Go fight back. You know what? Uh, everything pumpkin spice, anything pumpkin spice related has to suffer. Starbucks pumpkin spice latte. <laughs> oh, let's go down this way. Uh. I'm not done with you yet. You know, oh, ah, maybe we are. <laughs> pumpkin spice Greek yogurt. It's a well-known scientific fact. You can't even grow pumpkins in Greece. So why would they have pumpkin spice Greek yogurt? <laughs> Another shower. Oh, <laughs> oh that was awesome. Oh, there's fucking yogurt in the trees. <laughs> All right, cold brew pumpkin coffee. No, just say no to cold brew pumpkin spice coffee. Oh. <laughs> Oh, this is gonna be a mess. Wardrobe. Oh, you died. <laughs> Oh, I bought two! Shoot! <laughs> oh. oh, my camera! Here's the saddest part right here. They're giving pumpkin spice to babies. <laughs> They're getting addicted early. I don't say no to that! <laughs> how mad I am. That's not even a pumpkin. It just looks like a pumpkin. <laughs> <sighs> mm. 
You know what though? <laughs> you really can't solve the problem until you get to the root of the problem. Yeah. I'm breaking out the chopper for this one. They clean this mess. <laughs> so there you go. Fight pumpkin spice wherever you can. I'll talk to you later.